back with eight Mario drinks. I'll be taste testing all of them, and I'll be making the Princess Peach and Bowser drinks from your comments. But most importantly, I'll be using the drink liquids to recreate the glorious Mario movie poster. Is it even possible, or is it just gonna be a big puddle of drinks on a piece of paper? Well, uh, you guys are in for a big surprise. Why, hello there! Hey, everybody! Uh, it's been a while. Welcome back to another video. Now, I've been getting some comments that have been saying, like, Lightning Lane, you cannot color with your drinks. It's impossible. Hey, wait, what? I, of course I can color with my drinks. I'm going to recreate the entire Mario movie poster. What? <laughs> what, what? You, you can't do that. It's just gonna be a big puddle of drinks on a piece of paper. Okay, this is our piece of paper right here. And for the outline, I'm actually gonna be using Hershey's chocolate. So I'm pouring the Hershey's chocolate into this uh, little thing right here. Oh no, it's leaking. Uh, okay. Now that we've got the chocolate in here, we draw in with chocolate. Is it possible? Uh, well, it's, it's working. As long as I don't smudge the chocolate. So who am I drawing right now? That's right, we draw in Toad. He's, uh, he's a mushroom person. Now, one thing that I can tell you is, never underestimate a mushroom. I mean, these mushroom people might look small and innocent, but deep down, they're warriors at heart. And they've pledged their allegiance to the one and only Princess Peach. So I've attached my drinks to these plastic tubes, which are connected to this brush. This way, when I slightly squeeze the drink, the liquid comes out through the bristles. Uh, okay, uh, before we get to the coloring, cause uh, I don't know if it's gonna work or not. Uh, we're, we're, we're gonna taste test the Mario drink. Now, but we're, we're gonna we're gonna try it. We're gonna see how good it is. <sighs> and that's actually pretty good. I, I think they did a great job. I, I don't know what I gave the original, but I'm gonna give this um I'm gonna give it a seven out of ten. Okay, I'm just gonna start out really light here. I don't want to mess this up right at the beginning. Oh, okay, it's it's actually working. I just need a little bit more and squeeze a little harder. Oh my, oh, this is this is actually working, guys. Oh, not only does it look good, but it tastes good. Uh, okay, time for some of the chemic drink. Oh, perfect, this blue really stands out. And uh, okay, I need some of the toad drink for the, the skin color. Let's see here. Oh, uh, it's supposed to be more pinkish, but I, you know, I, I think it's still gonna work. Oh man, guys, we're, we're in new art territory right now. Now the Koopas, they've pledged their loyalty to the all-powerful battle. Uh, they're basically his little pawns that will do whatever he says. Koopas are really not that strong or smart by themselves, but when Bowser sends out hundreds of Koopas, then they become a big threat, like even for Mario and Luigi. Now, Kemek, on the other hand, he really stands out from the other Koopas, since, you know, he possesses these magical powers and potions. He's, he's basically an advisor for Bowser, and he's second command of the Koopa army. But you know, when you work for Bowser, it's like playing with fire. You know what, I, I haven't even tried the Koopa drink yet. Now, the only strange thing is that this drink, it came with these two notes. It says, warning, I messed up the chemic drink. It might taste a little weird. Wait, what else? Uh, by the way, I started with Blue Mountain Dew, blueberries, and a bunch of other things. Good luck. Oh man, I should not have read those. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna get this over with. It, it can't taste that bad. Oh. Oh, that's way too strong. Oh, snap. Oh, oh, oh my, I need some water. I, oh, my tongue, I, oh no. Oh, it tastes like a really strong blueberry energy drink. Two out of 10, bro. No, it's leaking. Oh no, it's not, this is getting out of hand. Oh, okay, the, the chemic drink might not taste the best, but uh, at least it colors really well. You know, if they sold these Mario drinks in the store, I, I think we'd have to get a better flavor mix for Chemic. We, we can't have people buying the Chemic drink and then spitting it all over the place because it's a two out of 10. Ah, that'd just be a disaster. And Chemic, he deserves way better than that. Uh, okay, we got some gray for the gray Dry Bones drink. Now, Dry Bones are, uh, well, they're basically dead Koopas, but they're still very much alive. Who is this that I'm drawing? Well, it, it gotta be Peaches. <laughs> now, I, I've gotta say, uh, drawing out Peaches like this, it, it's bringing back some memories of when I made the Peaches pancake art. I, okay, guys, there, there gotta be some people who remember that video. We, uh, we've gone from pancake art to uh, drink art, I guess. I, I don't know this. But this time, though, I, I'm drawing Peaches with a bit more detail. I mean, I gotta do this right. I can't mess up the Peaches drawing, and this drink, it gotta taste real good. But, you know, that's up to the ingredients. List. This time I went with your guys' comments on what you wanted in a peach drink and a Bowser drink. 
we're starting out with the peach drink. So let's see what you guys wanted. First of all, we've got peaches, pink lemonade, uh, animal crackers. Oh, I don't know about that one. Uh, marshmallows, uh, pink prime, pink ice cream bars, and pink cotton candy. Oh, okay, I, I need to go and get these ingredients. Has anyone actually seen Princess Peach eat a peach? I, I don't know, it's definitely a mystery. Now this is some fancy lemonade right here, top quality. Uh, the mushroom people must drink this at all of their celebrations. Animal crackers, ah, I hope these dissolve well. Little guy, at least he'll die with his friends. I will say marshmallows typically are a good choice, but you don't want to use too many of them or else they become too sticky. Oh my goodness, this stuff is already really sweet. It's like Kool-Aid and Gatorade mixed together. Now what really helps is to make a drink with tasty ice cream. Ah, that's, that's the real secret right there. If Flamingo isn't pink enough, then I don't know what is. I, I'd like to imagine that the clouds in the Mushroom Kingdom are just giant cotton balls of cotton candy, but that's probably not true. To be mixed to perfection, the princess only wants the best. Uh, this is a drink for royalty, but it kind of looks like Pepno Bismo. I, I don't know, okay, oh man, I hope the princess approves. I, I need the, I need the seal of approval. Peaches, 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 Whoa, 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 Bowser, I'll get out of here. No, no, it's not, it's not your turn yet. Leave peaches alone, okay. Uh, we, we, we need to see how this tastes. It's like a very smooth, fruity, strawberry ice cream flavor. I have to give this like, maybe like a 7.5 out of 10. Very good choices, guys. I can't believe this. Like you guys picked like the perfect ingredients. Like it made the perfect pink color. Like look at that. I, I know a lot of you are big fans of Princess Peach, uh, including me. Like the only thing I wish, uh, no, oh, oh, the drink is leaking. Ah, this can't be happening. Okay, I have to do this fast before it leaks through the paper towel. Um, okay, so we uh, we need to do some blue. We need to do some red. I, I can't do the blonde hair yet because I, I don't have the Bowser drink, which is yellow, but uh, we'll, we'll get there. We zooming on to Donkey Kong. This is one incredible gorilla right here. Like honestly, when it was Mario versus Donkey Kong, I, I, I didn't even know who to root for. Like, I mean, I love Mario. Mario, but at the same time, Mario kind of crazy, bro. Like, it to be going up against Donkey Kong? Oh. Now, I've been having people come up to me and say, Lane, I gotta know, what was your favorite part of the Mario movie? And I mean, that's such a tough question, but I gotta say the part where Mario and Luigi versus Wario and Waluigi in tennis? Oh, that tennis match is so exciting. Now, the part I didn't like in the movie was when Yoshi turns evil and joins Bowser. Oh, I did not see that coming, but uh, I mean, I understand. Uh, I, uh, no, 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 I'm just kidding. No, I made that all up. Uh, if you saw the Mario movie, you know that wasn't in there. Uh, but uh, anyways, you know, Mario 2 is gonna be coming out at some point, and I'm hoping we get to see some characters we haven't seen yet. Okay, uh, before I go any further, we need to try the Donkey Kong drink, cause uh, I, I, I just need to try this. This right here is probably the best tasting drink so far. It's a lot of banana, a lot of chocolate, and um, you know what? That might be the only ingredients in here. And 8.5 out of 10. Mm. Kind of tastes like water. Wait, wait, what? Okay, it's, it's probably like a very light tea or a very mild Snapple flavor. Five out of 10. This drink is not for the living, it's for the dead. Oh, it tastes like wet concrete. One out of 10, oh, get this drink away from me. Oh, oh, I can't get the taste out of my mouth. Oh, I might need some of that Mario drink again to get rid of the, of the dry bones taste. Maybe if I drink enough of the Mario drink, I'll, I'll get some type of power up, you know. Uh, oh, imagine that. If in real life we got power ups, I mean, all Mario has to do is eat a special mushroom and he'll either get really big or really small, which, I mean, okay, that's definitely pretty cool, but for me, the coolest power, it's gotta be the cat suit or the tanuki suit. Like, you might look pretty ridiculous wearing it, but having super cat reflexes or being able to fly around, oh, that makes it well worth it. Of course, we can't forget about the most insane power-up of all time. Okay, it's the superstar. You know, when Mario has that, he's pretty much God mode and he's unstoppable. He's just this powerful superhero. But, um, you know, there are a few power-ups that I, we didn't get to see. And I'm curious if they're going to have them in the Super Mario 2 movie. I'm really hoping we get to see Mario in the, the penguin suit. 
And with the fire flower power. We need that. The fans need that. We going on to the other brother. Luigi! Now, I must say, this guy right here, yeah, he unfortunately doesn't have the best of luck. I, I mean, in the movie, Luigi ends up in a dark place, you know, this haunted graveyard filled with dry bones. They're just everywhere, chasing around poor Luigi, and I'm telling you, dry bones, they're way more aggressive than Koopas. In fact, I, I don't even know how you would defeat a dry bones, because they just keep coming back, even when you knock them apart. You just gotta run, you, you have to outrun them. Uh, just don't go hiding in a haunted mansion. Uh, that just doesn't turn out too well. Luigi! Now, um, I, I do not know what's in this drink. It's a very green drink. So uh, I'm in for a surprise here. Let's uh, see what it tastes like. Hmm. It kinda has a, a lime taste to it with a little bit of jello in there. And it actually works. A seven out of 10, just like the Mario drink. In fact, now I have both of the brothers together. They are unstoppable. Now, ah, this one's leaking too. Ah, I can't have it dripping all over the place and ruining the drawing. Oh man, I, I'm telling you though, oh, that Luigi drink, it, it would definitely be a bestseller because it tastes good. And you know, people really seem to like Luigi. You know, he's been in the shadow of his brother Mario for a long time, but over the years, he's become more than just a sidekick. What I'm really hoping to see in Super Mario 2 movie is Luigi with his vacuum backpack, sucking up ghosts. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to introduce to you the king himself. He is seen as the great villain, the uncontrollable monster whose uh, fiery eyes are set on world domination and uh, getting rid of those uh, annoying little green and red plumbers, you know. Uh, through, throughout the Mario series, he's always been seen as the bad guy, but I, I gotta say, it's, it's not necessarily that straightforward because he's also probably one of the most misunderstood characters. Not all of his actions are just pure evil. In fact, a lot of his actions are because, uh, well, he is blinded by love. His love for the princess. And uh, love can make you do crazy things that uh, other people just don't understand. The all-powerful Bowser. Now, these are ingredients from the comments. So I don't know what's on here and I'm very nervous. Let's see here. We have uh, the first ingredient, orange juice. Uh, okay, uh, uh, tea. Yeah, it's not too bad. Uh, 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 popsicles! Uh, 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 Mr. Beast chocolate! Uh, actually, all these things are pretty good so far. Uh, is that, I think that's it, right? Yeah, there's nothing. Oh, wait, wait, oh, wait, oh no. Uh, hey, evil magic juice! Oh no, wait, wait. Uh, bones of his enemies! No, no, I. I okay, I. Uh, wait, 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 wait. You must sacrifice. Wait, what do you mean? Sacrifice what? I. Kids, Mario, Luigi, and Toad. Wait, why? No, these must be two different people. I guarantee you. This was one person's comment. This was someone else's. How, how am I supposed to combine these two together? And who, who put this in the comments, huh? Who, who was that? 100% power. It looks like a lot of these ingredients are gonna be yellow. Uh, energy tea. It got the lightning bolt power on it. Oh, definitely gonna be a big energy boost to the levels. Okay, uh, these are the only type of kids I could find. And we're gonna sacrifice the yellow ones. Uh, death by pounding. I'm sorry I have to do this. Oh, please forgive me. Ah, bone broth and some evil magic juice from Chemic. Uh, I can't get this open. Why, what's going on? Uh, oh, I have to stab it. Oh, no, no, it's not a pretty sight. Uh, it's the only thing I can think of. Uh, okay, I just need uh, like one or two drops of this because it's really strong. Uh, so let's see here. I, uh, oh, snap, oh, snap. I, oh, I just ruined it. Oh, no. The Mario Bros, uh, gummies, and uh, yellow banana popsicle. It's been nice knowing you, but it's time for you to die. I, okay, uh, no. Oh, 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 just threw everyone in there. Uh, at least these popsicles look good, you know, make it a little bit of a frozen dessert. I, I don't even know what the point of this is. I, I, it's just going to get blended up anyways, so... Um, it's like a yellow goo at this point. Oh, I don't know if it's gonna mix. If there's anything that's gonna save this drink, it's gonna be the Mr. Beast chocolate. Uh, yeah, uh, Bowser, uh, he would uh, devour this down in uh, in seconds. Oh, there's enough energy and power in this drink to, to conquer the galaxy. Oh man, um, I, I know Koopas could drink this, but I, I don't know if I should drink this. Any volunteers out there who are willing to drink the Bowser drink for me? Any, no, come on. Oh, 
Oh, oh snap. The comments are gonna go crazy, but um, this drink right here, it's a sweet orange slushy. I, I gotta give it like an eight out of 10. I have to be honest. I, I know he's supposed to be a villain, but the drink's pretty good. I, oh, ugh, bitches, oh. Why did I just say that? As we all know, Bowser desperately wants to marry Princess Peach, but the, the reality is, is it's never gonna actually happen. But Bowser, oh, he, he can't even handle the thought of that. He must have her, even if he must kidnap her. It, it's the only way because uh, just maybe she'll see how great and charming he truly is. And if that doesn't work, uh, <laughs> He's gonna have to sing to her, which oh, that's actually a terrifying thought right there. If Princess Peach ever did turn evil and join Bowser, I don't think there's any way to stop them. Uh, you know, I, I'm realizing I'm using a lot of yellow here. I, I'm glad I made a lot of Bowser drink because uh, I have to cover a lot of this paper. But as for Bowser in the movie, he doesn't succeed in his mission. He fails, he's humiliated by the Mario Bros. And I mean, for him, it's a tragedy. I think the only villains that could actually beat Mario and Luigi are Wario and Waluigi. Uh, Bowser, he's gonna have to team up with them, and I think that's my guess for what's gonna happen in the in the Super Mario's 2 movie. This is my favorite part, guys. I'm gonna use some magic, jump ahead, and reveal to you the final completed drawing. Are you ready for this? Ah, Super Mario Bros! Oh, what the? Oh, this looks sick. Uh, it definitely took a while, but oh man, the fact that this is drawn with chocolate and colored with drinks, oh, it, it just makes it so much cooler. Of course, I didn't get every detail of the movie poster, but I feel like I got close enough. This is poppin'. And here it is, the official Mario drink movie poster. Let me know in the comments which drink slash drawing ideas I should do next. You never know. Your idea could end up in the very next video. Anyways, you guys.